Welcome to this week's University of Colorado Health feature player profile as we sit down with Eagles defenseman John Ryder. And you know, Ryder, you're one of those guys that grew up here in the state of Colorado for a good chunk of time. So that makes it a little more interesting when we ask, you know, what were some of the things you liked about growing up here in Colorado? Well, I actually grew up in Colorado Springs, but my family lives in Fort Collins, so I spent a lot of time around here. And probably the same as every other kid. I love the mountains. I love being in the mountains. Probably for 23 of the 24 years I've been alive, every day I've gotten to wake up and look, at, look out the mountains on my window in the morning. So that's something I can never get tired of. Now, I know there's a lot of DU guys on the team. There's uh, your one CC guy in the room and Arthur Bidwell and Ryan Bach, the goaltending coach. But kind of give us a sense of why, when you're at DU, you hate CC, things you disliked about CC. I think it's just the, the gold pan. I mean, they're pretty much rivals in everything. They're very similar schools. Same state, they're just 60 miles apart. You know, the hockey teams, they were rivals from the start, and you just don't like to play them. It, it gets intense. You don't like their fans. Their fans don't like you. You don't like their players. And I'm from the Springs, and I went to DU, so <laughs> it makes it a little bit even more intense when I got to go home and people thought I was a traitor. And <laughs> That's awesome. Well, how about uh, we get into some, some different sorts of things. Uh, your favorite snack, let's say you were to go to a vending machine, pull out a snack out of a vending machine, what would you most likely pick? I love goldfish. Really? Yeah. I really like goldfish. It's one of those things where I actually can't buy it because I'll eat the whole bag in, like, in one sitting. <laughs> How about a food you just cannot stand? You, you you cannot eat it, won't get it on anything. Oh, I hate celery and I hate onions. <laughs> really? I don't like the texture. I don't. They're tasteless, but I just can't stand the texture. How about your roommate on the road? Who's your roommate on the road? Do they have any kind of odd quirks about them? Actually, my roommate on the road is my roommate at home. It's Bids. Oh, really? So we pretty much, for a long time, we were completely together. We were D partners on the road, and we were at home. So um, we're pretty similar. We just we go to bed early. We're, I don't know, we watch the same TV shows, so it's not not much. He went to CC, so that sucks, but <laughs> can I say that word? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> How about uh, when you guys do sit down and watch TV shows? What are some of your favorite shows to watch? Uh, we watch a lot of, like, like Pawn Stars. We watch a lot, a lot of National Geographic, like... Anything that you know has to do with like animals or in the wild, stuff like that, it's just stuff that's interesting. Well, and you talk about Pawn Stars. Have you been to the Pawn Stars shop out there in Las Vegas yet? I haven't been there, no. Are you planning on going when you go out to Vegas? Um, I would go, depending. I've heard the lines out the door all yes. the time, so. I've met those guys in the airport before, so. Really? Who'd you meet? Uh, all of them. They were all sitting at a table in Minneapolis, and we, we stopped and just said hi to them. They must have been pretty tired because they weren't in the best mood. <laughs> Was the old man there? Um, the old man was there. <laughs> he's never in a good mood. So yeah, I, he's always good. I understand that. Uh, so did you grow up in Colorado a, a fan of the Broncos, the Rockies, the teams here? Yeah, I've always been, especially since the Avs moved, we were always fans of the Avs. Always just always a Broncos fan. Not so much, when I, when I was growing up, the Rockies had just started, so they weren't that popular, but when I, in the springs, their AAA ball team is the Sky Sox, and that's... You know, so you, I think you're always a, some type of Rockies fan there. Now, if you get a day off, let's say you're on the road, what are you most likely to do? Probably just find some find some good food, hang out, watch some TV. If you have a friend in the other, you know, on the other team, maybe go spend some time with them, something like that. Last question for you is: If you were going to go on a, a dream vacation, you could go anywhere in the world. Maybe you set up shop there and retire. Where would it be? I, for a dream vacation, I would definitely I want to go to Bora Bora someday. I like that French Polynesia area. Somebody else said they want to go to Bora Bora. I think it was Brock Nixon. Somebody had said that. So maybe you guys can go together. Maybe we can go hit together. Hit the beach. Yeah. Absolutely. I got a buddy who lives in Australia, too, so it would be fun to like, go there and see him, spend some time. You know. How about retirement? Do you want to stay here in Colorado? Or would you like to go somewhere warm? Where would you like to retire? I'd probably like to stay in Colorado. I'm born here. I haven't ever left except for maybe once or twice. I don't think I'm going to leave. All right. That is this week's University of Colorado Health feature player profile. It's Eagles defenseman John Wright.